everyone, I'd like to share with you my page for my May mini page swap that I'm hosting on my blog. The design paper that I chose was Fashionista, so let me share with you what I did. On the 4x4 medium weight chipboard, I basically painted both sides with some black acrylic paint. On this page, I adhered the design paper. I distressed it, then etched it with a black soot. And one of the items that needed to be incorporated on the page was the twisted flower. So these are some white Prima Hydrangea flowers that I glimmer mist with the red velvet. And then I twisted it, as you can see here. And then I added a white Prima Baby Rose in the center. These are some white Prima leaves that I glimmer mist with the olive vine. And then I added some black lace. You want to at least leave a quarter of an inch to half an inch of space here for the binding. They can either put a ring here or two rings here or they can use the bind at all. And then on the other side, so either side, one had to at least incorporate a pocket along with the tag. So on this page, again, I added the design paper and this is the back of this design paper. And so I edged it, again, distressed it with a black soot. And for the pocket, I used a coin envelope. I got some red basil card stock and then just adhered it to the pocket. And then I cut the top using some decorative scissors then distressed it with the black soot distress ink. On top of the pocket, I used my uh, French script stamp and then I heat set it with some clear embossing powder. And then on top of that, I add this uh, sizzlet frame. Um, because the sizzlets, you can only cut it with cardstock because they are very thin. So I layered it with cardstock and then design paper on top, just so it, it's a little bit thicker. And then I added a black bling in the center, and then I added some diamond dust around the entire frame. This is an image that I cut from the design paper. Here are some Prima baby roses, and in the center I added the white Prima hydrangea flower, and then again I twist it. And then I added some black feather right here. So again, enough space here. We lift the feather here for binding. So. This could be the front, or this could be the front. You can go either way. And then for the tag, um, basically I edged it with a black soot. I added a black extra large eyelet. And then I added a pearl charm and some glittery black fiber. And then I glimmer mist this with the mustard seed and stamped ooh la la. And then the back, I glimmer mist with the lime twist. So that's my page. I had a very fun time creating this and I'm really excited to see all the pages put together to create the complete mini album. And I just want to thank you everyone again for participating. Um, let me give you a couple of bit information on the swap. Basically the swap is going to be on the 5th of every month. So be sure to check my blog for signing up. And basically how the sign up works is the first 8 that sign up is going to be the first group and then the next eight that sign up is going to be the second group. So there's no um, particular way I set the groups up. It's just first come, first serve. I just want to make it fair for everyone. And so for the birdcage swap, it's going to be the seventh of every month. Again, check my blog for posting and then sign up. So as you guys sign up, I'll start listing the names on my blog. This way you can see who's in. Um, in the swap. So I'm really excited and I can't wait. And thank you everyone for watching. Bye.